One day, my mom, she tried to drown me in her own bathtub. Her hand was on my head. I saw her try to grab her hand, try to jerk it, jerk away. I was like, I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm gonna run. There's a war going on in America, and it's called fighting for America's teens. And unless you and I do something significant, we're going to lose an entire generation. Hi, I'm Sarah Trollinger. House of Hope is a Christian residential home for hurting teenagers, boys and girls between the ages of 12 and 18. We offer professional counseling and an accredited educational program on a beautiful 10-acre campus in the center of Orlando, Florida. I invite you to peek into the shattered lives of hurting, neglected, abused teens who've been looking for love in all the wrong places. Listen to their cry and watch as they receive their healing. I started drinking and I started doing things with guys. It became really depressing because my mom was never really there to find out what's happening. I found I had a lot of anger problems. And most of it came because my dad wasn't there. I became an alcoholic by the time I was 14. On the outside I seemed happy, but on the inside I knew what I was doing wasn't right. I just knew that I was either going to lose my daughter or find some place for her. And um, by the grace of God, I found the House of Hope. Our goal at House of Hope is to reconcile teens with their parents through counseling, education, love, and most importantly, prayer. I'm a lot better with my mom. I'm talking to my dad again, and it's better. I finally started working on myself and you know, trying to start forgiving myself for the things I've done to people. I'm trying to forgive other people for what they've done to me. Since I've come to House of Hope, like, I've been delivered from, you know, the fear and the harm and the sex and the drugs and, you know, wonder if I'm pregnant and, you know, if I'm going to overdose or if I'm going to die. It's freed me from, like, all the fear. I live within the shadow of the Almighty, sheltered by the God who is above all gods. This I declare that He alone is my refuge, my place of safety. I guess my new purpose is God now. I see more in it. Before I was here, I always knew I wanted to do better. I always knew about God, but I always kind of put Him out there outside the window, just looking in. And now that I got Him in my life, I think I'm going to do better with Him. I also hope it's a great place for me. It turned my life around. This place has changed my life. And I know that when I leave here, I'll be a stronger person. You know, obviously God has a plan for me. If He spared my life all those nights that I was drinking and driving, and you know, I never OD'd, I never got alcohol poisoning, and I never got an STD. House of Hope is exactly that, hope. And um, before we got here, we didn't have any. House of Hope is truly a place of miracles, a place filled with God's love. A place of hope, a place that's totally dependent on caring people like you to help save this generation. The House of Hope sends a powerful message. There is a way for teens and their families to overcome life's damaging influences and become healthy, contributing members of society. The teens and families of Hampton Roads deserve a house of hope, but we need your help to make it happen. From community service to leadership roles to financial support, you can change a life and make Hampton Roads a better place. Give troubled teens of Hampton Roads hope, a house of hope. They never turn a teenager away because of finances. That's why they need your help. Would you sponsor a teenager today through the House of Hope? Pray for them, support them, and send your check today.